you had about 160 uh, show up for midnight practice, get things started, good way to start the season. Oh, great way to start the season. The kids are fired up. Uh, they're doing a great job. Our one more theme this year is elite, and they've been really elite. They finished the school year elite in the classroom. They've been elite during workouts. Uh, they were elite when doing community service at the women's shelter. Uh, you know, they, they, they're excited, they understand what's at stake, and it's just, you know, there's a great buzz in the air. Um, they don't focus on the past, they focus on what they want to do this year, and we've got a, you know, a large senior group, great leaders, uh, leaders spiritually, leaders on the field, so we're just excited. In your ninth year, this has got to be your most experienced team ever returning in terms of the starters, you've got, uh, what, 10 on defense and 7 on offense? 13 on uh, defense, 6 on offense. So I say 13 because we rotate the D-line. So uh, a lot of kids coming about and a lot of kids that are excited and a lot of kids that have uh, really done a great job throughout, you know, of, of living by our three creeds, giving great effort, being focused and loving one another. A very close-knit group and, and a group almost to the point where you've got a lot of coaches on the field. But they're hungry, you know. We, we've all got these cliches. We, we want them all in. I think this year's elite, not good, great, excellent. We want to be elite. Uh, but I think more than anything, the key for them is they love one another, and uh, you know it shows in the way they practice and push each other. Again, that, that first game against Overhills, August 21st, is right around the corner. Yes, sir. And the kids, uh, that, that's our focus. You know, a lot of people want to talk about, you know, you got a tough out of conference schedule, you're playing the toughest conference in the state. We just take it one game at a time. Every week's the state championship, the Super Bowl, and uh, you know that that is what we want our kids to focus on, keeping their eyes on that prize. Good luck to you this season, coach. Thanks, Mike. Thanks for everything. If it's sports you want, we've got it covered. MoreSportsRadio.com.